Hello YouTube and welcome to my channel, Adult Fan of Lego UK. Indeed this is a brand new channel, this is my first ever video, my first ever review. Um, I'm hoping, straight planning to do a number of these for the foreseeable future. Um, I'm an adult fan of Lego, um, I predominantly collect Star Wars, both new and old sets. Um, so I'm hoping to do a combination of reviewing new sets that come out and also I'll be doing some um, older reviews of some of my um, collection I already have and, and as and when I add to that collection also. Not just Star Wars, I will review other sets as well. Um, I have two young boys, um, the oldest of those is five so he's really starting to get into Lego at the moment so as and when he gets sets as well I hope to be able to review those too. So straight into this, uh, today as you can see I'm going to be reviewing as part of the new Star Wars 2013 summer theme Set 75019, the ATTE, um, ages 9 to 14. This has got 794 pieces um, and five minifigures, um, all of the minifigures being new to the Star, Star Wars um, range or improvements. Some of them may not be new, but they've been um, obviously improved on previous versions. So, what we can see here is the box, there's the front of the box. It's been around to show you guys the back. You can see on there, the back demonstrates some of the functions which are many on this set. Uh, the box side. Sturdy box actually. The only thing I wasn't keen on is the way you have to open these and know, which is having to tear that bit there, which actually tore the box on me, which I'm not keen on, but the box. It's actually a really sturdy and strong box. Okay, before I move into the actual set review, it comes with two instruction manuals. You can see there, number one, and number two. Okay, right, first thing I want to say about this set actually, before I go into the actual review, is this is an absolutely fantastic set in my opinion. Really, really pleased with it. I bought this um, Saturday just gone. I think that was the day this new range came out uh, from my local store in Blue Water here in the UK. Um, I built it that evening. Um, and yeah, I've been really, really impressed with it. So I'm just going to move on to the minifigures. So the first minifigure is the Elite, sorry, the Battle Droid Commander. You see there. The commander actually got some good yellow markings on the top of his head and also the yellow dot on his torso. It comes with kind of your standard blaster pistol. Not a lot to really say about that. It's a droid, droid commander, but really good colour. I like this this colour um, and this 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 new droid. Okay, next up is just your standard Battle Droid, so pretty much the same as the other one, but without the yellow markings. Okay. Again, really nice colour in these new droids. Okay, next up we have Mace Windu. You see there, he's got some really good printing actually on his torso and on his legs comes with a purple lightsaber only one sided face but yeah really good printing it's a mace window next up we have Coleman Treble Probably pronounced that wrong, so I'm sure I'll be corrected. Again, really good minifigure. Some really good detail, good printing. Um, comes with the green lightsaber. Get that out of the way. Uh, printing to his torso and some printing to the legs. Also, some back printing. Obviously, the standout feature on this guy is his head. Some really good detail on his head. Really good minifigure, really pleased with this one. And he's got kind of a uh, 
rub it. You see, hopefully, moving there, kind of a rubber texture to his head. Okay, final minifigure is the actual clone troop commander. Again, really good minifigure. Some really good details on this one. I love the yellow on this guy. His helmet, his arms. You can see the dots on his chest there, representing that he's the commander, the clone commander. Comes with a rifle. I'll just show you that. Okay. Just back to this guy, some good printing on the front. That's the rear of his torso. Take his helmet off. Yeah, kind of the stand. Clone head and again single sided only. So that's the minifigures. Okay, so into the actual set itself. Let's move that out of the way. First thing actually is this here. It's a really good lever which you can pick this up with and move them around. Um, and again, the things I want to say about this this is a really strong sturdy set that you can really really throw around actually although this is ages 9 to 14 um, which I tend to agree with from a build point of view um, the actual playability on it uh, my son who's five um, he had a little bit of a play with this um, but certainly five um, and upwards you know this is a really 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 um, good set with lots of functions on it which I'm going to obviously take you guys through. So first thing, so I'm going to go from the front, in fact the top, first thing on this we've got this turret cannon on top which goes all the way around 360, you can see up and down, really great space in there, sitting minifigure, these here are flick fire missiles, I'm not going to flick it off because I'll lose it but See there, standard flick fire missile in red. Right, actually, and underneath this, this lifts up. What well, we can actually see here are some more flick fire missiles, which is quite a nice little addition there. Some yellow ones and some blue ones as well, and they just slide in on these sliders here into there just like that and that closes down quite nicely right in here the front of the set is where your actual commander sits so that just slides out you see there is a little seat and he's got two controls so I'm going to get our commander just put his helmet back on just put him in his seat like so he will just slide, hopefully, I've got to raise his arms up. He will slide back into there. So there we now have our commander ready to control the ATTE. You can see there, you see him in the side, see him in the front. So. So that moves all these here and here, move around. You can see the legs all move around. And again, look, really, really sturdy set. These all um, adjust as well. That's mainly just so you can get into the set. You could just come off. You could put other minifigures in there and push. Um, but it's not really designed um, for that. Uh, and this is just mainly uh, so you can move pieces around and kind of get in there. Okay, back on. Okay, there you go. Um, right, moving around to the rear. Let's see, here at the back, you got some steps, obviously. They're going to be leading somewhere. 
so where they actually lead is into the back of this so sorry you've got some more obviously cannons on the back there again they all move round this lifts up like so I'm just going to move these out just give us a bit more review in there um, yeah so in the back area is where you can put some minifigures um, this here is like a little chest you can see and inside it which I'm not entirely sure what they are you've got these little discs here which are actually printed there's two of those well in fact there was three um, there was a spare that came with it but there's only actually two as part of the set as per the instructions so they go in there I'm gonna put that back in there okay and what I do what I did with my set is actually stand my drawers up there because I use this for display purposes being a collector so I put my two battle droids in there and we've actually got some little clips for all weapons in here so I'll just put that one there and that one there and the only one thing that I did find was the clone commander's rifle there was nowhere really to put that so I just slide it in the back of there with those guys um, yeah, some really good detail. You've got some stickers in here. Bring that up here, so you can see. Stickers there and there. There's a number of stickers on this set, which I'll show you in a second. Let's just take this back it down, push that back in. Shoot. Yeah, there we go, back in place. So we have sticker, 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 uh, sticker at the top here, another sticker there, um, those two stickers in the back and I think that's pretty much it. So we've now got three minifigures in there, the droids and the commander and what I do for my display is have, I'm not going to put their sabers back on, I'm conscious but I kind of have these two just... Um, next to the ATTE, so pretty much depicting the scene really. And those guys running against it, so I think that's pretty much it. I'll give you a couple more. I'll show you these also stickers there as well, these long ones here. And you can see some of the, the detail on this set. It's a really good set, really, really pleasing. Lego done a great job. Just so sturdy, really impressed actually with how strong this set is. Um, yeah, I think that's pretty much it, but I hope that's given you guys a good idea. Um, so, like I said, I got this in the UK, price was £79.99. pence. Um, I think it's pretty good value for money, um, for some really good playability, it's going to look excellent um, with the rest of my. Um, display so yeah really really pleased with it um, hope you like this video I'd welcome any comments and feedback obviously this is my first ever video so I'm sure I've got a lot to learn and a lot to improve on but I hope you've given you guys a good insight into this particular set um, I hope you subscribe to my channel I'm obviously going to need to get some subscribers on board and I hope you like this video and give it that thumbs up catch you soon thanks bye